yeah 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 he be so in the building man that's good yo so like i wanna show you something very quick guys because i just discovered something crazy like have you noticed that this sign always changes right this google sign sometimes it's like books you see today it's like uh, let me show you it's like musical instruments mm. like it gives you that music vibe when you when you just look at this icon there on the google on the google sign on the google tag here you see it's like a piano and some notes like don't it just give you like some musical vibes so this is what i discovered that like they this is how they program us basically understand they you see like ask yourself why what what what's the need for them to actually change this google sign every day you know why should they put different icons on the google sign why, sh why should they personalize it that's what you should ask yourself so today right i wrote on my task book right so it's a book that i write tasks that i have to do right or projects so i wrote a couple of things right just a few things actually because i've been trying to limit and get to the important ones so now today i woke up on fire trying to attack just those three fucking projects that i had you understand and then by the time the first one i didn't have to go on internet to do the first one you understand because it involved a lot of writing so i was writing that and then the second task it was about doing stuff on gmail you understand then when i logged on and then i saw this google sign like I, I only looked at it a couple of seconds that's when i searched that softonic whatever right i only looked at it for just a few seconds just like a microsecond not even paying attention to it just looking okay it's a different sign oh it's google it's fine okay softonic download whatever and then i move on to other icons as you can see i've opened other task bars actually you understand and then I find myself listening to music all day, guys. Let me tell you, I was only supposed to go and do some Gmail stuff, right? I, I wanted to open another Gmail account, so I didn't even open that account because one thing, um, that account I couldn't open it, right? And then I just found my, myself after like saying, okay, let me give myself a break, and then I'll come back to it, honestly, because. I don't know somehow it becomes difficult to create another gmail these days because i don't know why maybe it's because i have a lot of it but like this is how they use predictive programming understand to distract you from doing your things the way you want them to be done understand they use these personalized icons on their fucking um, websites you know platform so that when you come on the platform they already know that 90 percent of the people in the world are gonna be listening to music in the very same way i got swept under that vortex myself without even knowing i just realized it now that boom this is the fucking shit that made me listen to music all day because i was watching youtube videos and other stuff like most of the time you understand and then I actually came back and did the work so after doing the work that I, that was remaining and then i came back to cut like clear my fucking browser you understand because i always clear my browser before i sleep so that i can wake up and it's, everything is fresh you know? so now when i was about to clear up this one i noticed that boom this music sign it programmed me it, like it almost fucking programmed the whole day understand it almost fucking swept my whole day away just because of this fucking like it's, it's just a piano note and some few notes on the side but it, it's a very cool icon by the way but i'm just saying that this is how they use predictive programming to work to distract you from actually focusing on one thing that you want to do when you log on onto the internet understand because they know that a lot of people 
they use internet like based upon their stats they've already figured out that okay a lot of people use internet for these kind of things right so for us to control how they use these kind of things we have to put some certain roadblocks on the net so that we can catch them there and then and then they won't do whatever that they wanted to do effectively you understand so yeah i'm not bashing out these platforms or companies they are very good companies they, like without these people we would we wouldn't even be communicating like this right now you understand through these videos whatever whatever so and sharing these important insights that you can think about it's not like they want to program you. it's just that they put it out there you know so that it can be a a way of filtering so that they can control whatever that they want to control on their platform you understand because if you create a platform and then you expect people to control it then it's it soon will never be yours anymore I understand because they'll take it from you so you have to put certain roadblocks so that you can always sway them in your direction you know but for me this is how it programmed me today that like i was only trying to fucking do a gmail account and i wanted to download some software right and then after typing this software thing i went back to the gmail and then i couldn't do it but I, i've just done it now before shooting the video so but after just seeing this icon i don't know i i never even looked at it i just noticed that it's different today it's not blue like the usual and then i moved when i got i don't know what happened i found myself just watching a lot of videos as you can see i've opened three whatever's already you understand for youtube so and some spotify so you can really tell like this predictive programming is real understand so yeah just be careful of it don't yeah, like pay attention to the icon signs and everything that you see on the internet because those are root blocks you understand just like on the street there are blockages or signs that you have to follow or that have to give you a certain direction so that even if you want to go to where you are going you will still follow the road signs that you are using understand so yeah hippie soul in the building man predictive programming hashtag all that cancel man stop it youtube stop it google give us what you want man hippie soul in the building man love you guys